Well, ready for liftoff. Crew 3 is ready to take off from Kennedy Space Center and make their way to the International Space Station. That's right. Today's highly anticipated launch has actually been weeks in the making. It's been delayed since Halloween. So what can we expect to see? Our Amanda Hawley joins us live from Kennedy Space Center, a place that she loves. You have the very latest. What's going on, Amanda? <laughs> Well, right now, we're just kind of hoping for some of these clouds to clear out. We've seen some drizzle pass by at times. There is a little bit of a clearing off in the distance behind me, but right now, if all goes as planned, we're just under five hours from liftoff. Pad 39A, right behind me, we can see it. It's sitting pretty there. These four astronauts that are going to launch are launching on a reused Falcon 9 rocket, but the capsule itself is actually brand new. They're going to uh, have some upgrades on this, minor upgrades, if you you will just some radiation protection for some of the computer systems on board. Uh, they have a different docking adapter here. This is where they actually mate to the International Space Station. So a little bit different mechanisms there and some slight upgrades to the toilet on board the Crew Dragon capsule. It's about a 20 to 22 hour ride up to the International Space Station. Now the crew has been here for about two weeks. They arrived about two weeks ago. So if you take some take a look at some video here, we caught them making their way to Kennedy Space Center after leaving Texas and they've just been hanging out. Now one of them did have a minor medical issue that delayed one of the launch opportunities last week, but that has been since cleared up. So that's some good news. Uh, and of course, weather delayed the first launch. We also had the return of crew two. those astronauts returned late Monday night. So about a 48 hour turnaround between those astronauts coming home and these four astronauts lifting off from here at Kennedy Space Center. Again, launch time at 9.03 Eastern time this evening. Weather, the uh, Space Force giving it a 70% chance of a go. But again, we're watching the thick clouds that are around us, the drizzle that kind of comes by at times. We're hoping that they're going to clear out uh, just in time for that launch. It's an instantaneous launch window. So that means it's go or no go right at 9.03. Guys. All right, we're patiently waiting, uh, we as I'm are. sure I they mean, are, too. I think they're ready to go yeah. after this. Amanda Holly, live from Cape yes. Canaveral. Thank you.